Hey, this is Kevin Kitchens, Once Upon a Game, and today we're going to take a look at uh, an unbagging of the Heroes of Normandy Battle Generator for the Lock and Load Tactical Series. This is an expansion uh, add-on for the Heroes of Normandy uh, series. Uh, it does require that you own the Heroes of Normandy uh, game in order to play, or to use the, the Battle Generator. So let's crack the seal and see what we got inside here. Take a look at that here first. Um, generator is based in a point system defined by the size of the battlefield you want to play and then modified up or down by the variables of the battle. This means you get to the action fast. So it does say you, it requires a Heroes of Normandy uh, base game. Um, the game includes player aid cards and the battle generator manual. So that's what we should find inside, right? Alright, side. And you'll see here we have player aid cards and the battle generator manual. It's another nicely uh, printed book. Uh, you know, using their new system. And this one is stapled on the side, but that shouldn't matter too much. Looking at the uh, table of contents here. Got a, um, to define the battle, building the battle map, attacker versus defender troop setup, meeting engagement troops setup, reinforcements, define troops, and define optional weather. Full color, nicely done. Um, small battles, medium battles, large battles. Single map, two map, four map. Obviously, uh, just takes you through the scenario. Most of this is available online uh, for print and play. You can print this manual out yourself, I believe. Uh, I've not looked at that, um, but someone was asking what you actually get in the book or in the uh, expansion. And so, what you're going to get is the instruction manual, point cost of the different units. American, being only it's got American and German. So we go to page 32 for the actual uh, generator rules, credits, and advertisements. Heroes of the Nam just came out. Should be shipping soon. Let's take a look at that one. Um, here's the Falklands, another interesting campaign. Alright. And you get the two charts, which seem to be expanded versions of the force uh, point charts, you know, the German and American uh, point builds out, leaders, infantry, support weapons, vehicles. So these are just for handy reference. Seems like most of this is inside the book as well. So there you have it. That's what you get in the Normandy version. Uh, take a look in another video at the Pacific version, but it's probably going to be pretty similar. So there you have it. Thanks.